The Hope One mini satellite was launched Tuesday. It is the first of its kind in China. It's especially designed to carry out special missions for the country's young people to experience aerospace science and technology. Peter Kovias once again has the story. The Hope One weighs only 60 kilograms and is less than a meter in length, but it's big enough to carry out missions 1,200 kilometers above the Earth. A leading task for the mini satellite will carry out an experiment with granules of five different colors in space. We prep the granules together during the launching process and release them with the satellite into space. We will observe the movement of the granules in the microgravity conditions of space. The experiment idea is from a second grader of a primary school who stood out from more than 100 candidates. Scientists think the idea can be associated with different areas of physics. Another mission of Hope One is to take pictures of the Earth from outer space with a small digital camera. The camera has a wide-angle lens. You can take panoramic pictures of the Earth while in orbit at different times. We hope young people can compare real pictures of the Earth with those they have imagined. The camera will be exposed in space. Scientists say it's strong enough to work in the extreme conditions and send images back to Earth through the satellite. The satellite is also loaded with radio equipment and expected to become the first station in space for radio amateurs. The signals from it can cover all amateur radio stations in a radius of 5,000 kilometers. We can send messages to radios in other countries. We send messages to the satellite, and they will then get messages from the satellite. Scientists say they will follow and monitor the satellite during its entire journey and carry out any adjustments through remote control. Peter Coveos, CCTV.